Everything in order? Yep. All right. The sun's gone down. Now might be a good time to consider where we'll set down for the night. No objections here. Hammerhead is like no garage ever. You know? One would expect no less of purveyors to the crown. Ah, <sighs> I'll miss it once this road trip's over with. Huh? There's no reason you can't pay them a visit anytime you please. I'm sure Cindy will be glad to look after your car. Oh, right. So, that's what this is about. If you need, I could always lend you the regalia. Whoa! <laughs> uh, thanks for the offer, but once we're back in the Crown City, I think I'd better score my own wheels. Knocked. The roads are perilous at night. We best head back into town. Yeah. Let's head back to town. Well then, let's call it a night. Might want to stock up on potions and stuff. Nice. You're being helpful for a change. What do you mean for a change? Pretty again. Take care of her, you hear? About a bite to eat. Take your pick. Appreciate it. Sick. Bon appetit. I dare say I could make this at camp. What do y'all want to know? Had your fill? Good. Huh. Gotcha. If y'all want to fix her up before you roll out, let me know. What'll it be? What coat do you fancy? Well, here's what I can do for How about the decals?
Be seeing ya. She's always so eager. I thought she might have been interested. Take a look at our wares. Pleasure doing business. Hey, come again. Have yourselves a good browse. Please come again. Could crash right here. Ditto. Everything in order? Yep. Mm -hmm.
Hey, wanna hit up the crow's nest? If you wish to put on weight, so... Lame. Yeah, I know. You all came all the way out here to deliver the goods. Well, thank you kindly. We'll dig it out of the trunk, so you all just sit tight. Umbra, bringing us stuff. Had a boy. A dog can really track a scent. Certainly knows how to find us. How do you always know, boy? Just a sec. Nice flower. It's the same kind we sewed our crowns from. Oh yeah, sill blossoms. So, hmm? I have a favor to ask. Take the notebook with you when you go. Sure. That's not all. I want you to put something in the book and send it back. All set. Take care out there. I know. You're not gonna tell me. Then don't ask. What was that about? <sighs> you don't say. Now that our work's done, let's see ourselves to Golden. to support you in times of need. Whatever would I do without you? Alas, count on it! You're right. Getting by. Yeah. 
To death, and yet we're all very much alive. Hmm. So, uh you think in a fairy tale, Lady Lunafreya, back to the Crown City? Nah, no need to rush to happily ever after. Wow. Still can't believe you're actually tying the knot, dude. How does it feel now that it's finally happening? Fine, I guess. Ah, come on, you can't fool me. Any guy would be over the moon to marry her. No big deal. Yeah, whatever. can't just leave my car and walk home. <sighs> I can't just leave my car and walk home. I think I got a pebble in my shoe. Take it out. Yeah. that up more quickly.
Beautiful day. Totally. Then lose the jacket. We're here. Everything in order? Yep. All right. For our next story, Lady Luna Freya of Tenebrae has issued an official statement regarding the forthcoming treaty. Words cannot express the joy in my heart on receiving word of this coming peace nor the pride I take in my betrothal playing a part in this historic moment. On this joyous occasion, some have voiced cause for concern. The fear I will be unable to fulfill my duties as Oracle. Please rest assured, my marriage will not stand in the way of my calling. You will find me in your towns and villages, as you always have, and I shall continue to bless you all. Lady Luna Freya will set forth from Tenebrae for her wedding ceremony in the coming days. Please be advised that during this time alone, her duties as Oracle will be suspended. It's in the treaty? Of course. Simple formality. One of those symbol of the peace deals. So it's more like a marriage of convenience. Her ladyship seems nevertheless amenable to the prospect. And Noctir likes the idea. <sighs> What's that? I do? Buzz off. I see it too. That's Golden Key. Kinda wanna go for a dip. That a big mountain behind it? No, it's an island. Nobody goes to Golden for an island though. They go to kick back and get massages. Can't say with the seafood. It's famously delicious. Sounds great. Something to look forward to. We need to replenish our supply of curatives. Gotcha. 